Yeah, Grand Unified Theory, Rational Response Squad's newest member, my name is Graydon Square, and I'ma always give it to you straight, yeah you too, look, yo, 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 I'm like the atheist spokesman, that's why I come under fire and pressure attacks like Rex Grossman. Haha, <laughs> yeah, this game is intense. I've been saying it's such a Gnostic. People have been playing the fence. You can say it's the same in the sense that evolution requires faith, that the universe just came to exist. First of all, microevolution's been proven in the same way that sound waves let you listen to music. And macroevolution is the system of change at or above the level of species inflicted with change. That's microevolution on the grand scale. We can't even work because our lifespan's too short to observe. But carbon dating is flawed. Its half life is 5,730 years. And that supports our cause. Now that'd be great if we used it to date. But since we don't, I'm a question that arguments wait. We use potassium argon to date the globe. Not carbon 12 or carbon 13, not none of those. So before you attack race, go get your facts straight. Because in the facts race, your God comes in the last place. Belief in gods, we can fix that. Irrational thoughts, we can dispatch. It may be hard, but we'll get back. Belief is just to end that. Belief in gods, we can fix that. Irrational thoughts, we can dispatch. It may be hard, but we'll get back. In the position just to end that. To battle me, you need to reason clearly. See, I'm not saying fear me, but at least be versed in punctuated equilibrium theory, grand unified fields, quantum mechanics, and dark planets, with logic that's sharper than the blade of dark canyons to destroy arguments of creationists who can't stand it. Then they try to hit me with the wager. Who? Pascal's wager. Who? Pascal's wager. Now that's a fool's bet. And against the intelligent, it's used less. Really? You bet. That ain't nothing new. They use it on kids. But for those who don't know, it goes a little like this. Wouldn't you rather believe in God and be wrong than to not believe in God and be wrong? If you believe in God and you're wrong, you've lost nothing. But if you don't believe in you're wrong, it's all suffering. The problem is, you can try it on anything. Switch the gods around, apply it to anything. The flying spaghetti monster, Zeus, I'm in Ra, Krishna, Odin, Ball, and then Allah. Which one of them's our god? None of them all false. And blame it on the atheists, it's always our fault. Except it never is. So don't get mad at us, we just showing y'all the evidence. Belief in gods, we can fix that. Irrational thoughts, we can dispatch. It may be hard, but we'll get back. In the position just to end that Belief in gods, we can fix that Irrational thoughts, we can dispatch It may be hard, but we'll get back In the position just to end that Alright y'all, I'm gonna take a break I'm tired Talking out the anus. Then go on to describe their lyrics as heinous. It's funny how threatening the music is, ain't it? To the typical, modern, theistically, hypocritical ignoramus. I gives a damn what your name is. For all intent and purposes, you can remain nameless or have the same name as Jesus, Buddha, Zeus, or Muhammad. Worshiping every star in the sky plus Haley's Comet. Why don't you believe in God? Why don't you believe in Ra? Huh? Why don't you turn to Pray to a lie. I'm just a guy speaking the facts. If you don't like it, you can leave through the back. Creationism is a joke, and I'll leave it at that. Look at these so-called damn brothers. Hell, I might as well be looking at their grandmothers. 
That's where they get it from many ways. Just brainwashed by the fear and the rent like many slaves. They scared of the truth. They scared of the truth. That's why they attack us. Try to make a crap about us. Because they scared of the truth. Try to go song for song when they jealous of us all along. It's cause they scared of the truth. They Man, they don't want it with us. Bottom line, they just wanna be us. Because they scared of the truth. your mediocre songs and your kindergarten blogs and stuff. Question. How could your God be jealous if he was the only one? How will we be his children when Jesus is his only son? There's just too many holes, but I'll leave you with this. If God was omnibenevolent, how could evil exist? Let me break it down even further. Say I had a pound of salt, and I asked you within it to find sugar. Okay. Where would it come from? If there was zero percent sugar content, then logically, you'd never find none. Teaching logic to this, you can forget it, because no matter how far you dumb it down, they just don't get it. So I swear to God. Which one? I don't care. Pick one. Ball, Apophis, Anubis, hell. How about Krishna? That I'll do whatever it takes to spread truth and to challenge everything that your God said do. My tongue is like the hammer of Thor. Nailing your deity to a cross and asking for more of grace and swear. That's why they attack us, try to make a crap about us. Try to go song for song when they jealous of us all along. It's cause they scared of the truth. Man, they don't want it with us. Bottom line, they just want to be us. Because they scared of the truth. Make your mediocre songs, they your kindergarten talk and stuff. When you understand why you reject all other gods, you'll understand why I reject yours. Stephen F. Roberts said that, and I take it to heart. Think, Think about, about it when I debate this and take them apart. I'm a child of one lesser God. No superstitious baloney, your moody, temperamental, invisible homies. If it exists, then show me. Not a book written by man with letters and words that's written by hand. But the Bible's God's inspired word. Prove it. Until you can prove the Bible was divinely inspired, then it's useless. Extraordinary claims require extraordinary evidence. If you don't believe me, ask the reverend, the site president. Our faith wasn't involved. Until he does, we just gonna stop listening to y'all, cause you talking in circles. We'll listen when you talk with a purpose, and that's real. That's why they attack us, try to make a crap about it. Cause they scared Try to go song for song, when they jealous of us all along. It's cause they scared Man, they don't want it with us. Bottom line, they just want to be us. Because they scared Make your mediocre songs and your kindergarten vlogs and stuff. It's cause they scared of the truth. That's why they attack us, try to make a crap about us. Cause they scared Try to go song for song, when they jealous of us all along. It's cause they scared Man, they don't want it with us, bottom line, they just want to be us. Because they scared Make your mediocre songs and your kindergarten vlogs and stuff. I also don't believe in Santa Claus, just so you know. I just thought I'd throw that out there. Or the Tooth Fairy. I'm sorry for the low key, Santa Claus does exist. I'll tell you like, or something. Santa Claus never existed for me. I grew up in group homes. We didn't have Santa Claus. They just gave me stuff. So, you cowards want to attack? Well, baby, it's on. But it won't be a pretty sight like old ladies and thongs. You think we running and you dead wrong? We staying right here. Great friends, the fundamentalist Christian nightmare. So who's right? None of y'all is dead wrong. Unbelievably big, can it close and headstrong? I fell on. Cause they ain't never gonna realize that Christianity has more holes in it than Spongebob. But that's cool. Take it on blind faith as I promote atheist nation movies on my space. And don't hate. You run these men into success. It sucks less than that phony religion that sucks less. Now these Christians wanna try to reconvert me. Before that happened, I joined neo-Nazi Germany. So go ahead, murder me, bastard. Cause I make atheists come out the closet faster than Ted Hag. Say that I'm lying. Say that they're from the spies. They gon' say that I'm from the